before I forget it! <laughs> oh, he's up to something again. Ha! <laughs> 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 a real T-Rex! Okay, that's interesting. Huge teeth, cardboard hmm? legs, wheels, motor... Uh, um, <laughs> Mr. Genius Scientist, what did you invent today? There you are, my faithful assistant. <laughs> we need to build a robot dinosaur. <gasps> that's a brilliant idea, Sammy. Let's do it. Who's going to make the first cardboard mechanical T-Rex if not us? <laughs> Hi, guys. I dreamt of an incredible craft last night. Hello. Yes, and today we're making a robot T-Rex out of cardboard. It can click its teeth and stomp its feet. Susie, that was my line. I invented the dinosaur. Oh, sorry, Dr. Genius, but we're going to make this craft together. Oh, uh, I forgive that little mistake. Oh, thank you. Oh, the greatest. <laughs> Guys, we'll need three cardboard sandwiches like these. I wish I could eat them. I like their circular shape. The radius of each circle detail is three centimeters. The inner part is slightly smaller. I'll tell you why later. While these details have a very small radius. Radius? It's like Eureka! <laughs> Actually, radius is a segment between the circle's center and any point of its edge. Don't you know that, Sammy? I know, Sue. I'm a scientist, but I like my version more. Anyway, I'm here to tell you I made the same sandwich detail. Here it is! Just in time! Because I've started making the first mechanism part. Are you making a top? Did you forget about that robot T-Rex? Not at all! It's the detail of our mechanism! I just want to make sure you don't mess things up. Guys, give a thumbs up if you're sure I am not going to mess up this craft. Yeah, I think I'm a nerd, but I made two details for the mechanism designed by me. No, Sammy, you're not a nerd. You're a scientist. All scientists are a little peculiar. You forgot one more circle. This one. I was testing your attention. You passed the test. Two. I cut and color the details for the dinosaur's body as I planned. Our mechanism's gonna work properly if the details are the right size. I measured everything with my cool professor's ruler. <laughs> I think you're a megalomaniac. I am, Sue. I'm a great inventor. Oh, are you gonna make tiny shakes? I guess your genius makes you forgetful today. There. And there. Great. We're making a robot T-Rex. And these straws are the details required. Yeah, no, Sue, you're great in upgrading my ideas. Oh, how nice of you, Professor Sam. Guys, do you invent things? Tell us about your projects in the comments. Most of our cardboard mechanisms run on elastic bands. These ones will make the details spin in sync. Connect them this way. By the way, remember how I told you about the grooves in the wheels? They are needed for the bands. This way they don't slip off. Now, let's fix this detail. The way the sticks enter the straws. Perfect! Sammy, may I ask your professor highness to bring me a glue gun? You're welcome, partner. <laughs> Did you notice how Sam becomes very strange when we're making a craft that's his idea? <laughs> Give a thumbs up to our genius scientist. Here, the body's almost ready. This will be the upper piece. It will hold the toothy T-Rex head. While this piece will open its mouth. Sammy, where'd you go? The inner mechanism is almost done. Don't you want to check it? I trust you, Sue. There's something super incredibly scientific going on in my lab. Phew. Finally, he trusts me. Shh. 
Let's move on to the next stage. We're going to make the chassis, consisting of the legs and a motor which will move them. I drilled the holes in these wooden pieces. The holes should be about two centimeters far from each other. The details must be directed upwards. So, I made a discovery. If you put Nutella on an Oreo and cover it with another cookie and eat it all, you get first with joy. <laughs> Sammy, I don't think they'll give you the Nobel Prize for that. Why? Isn't it the discovery of our age? All right, so tell me, what do they give the prize for? Well, there are five nominations. Physics, chemistry, medicine, literature, and peace. I think my discovery fits all of the nominations. Hmm, prove it. In the meantime, I'm going to glue this cute motor. Okay, physics. Nutella provides attraction between cookies. Chemistry. Molecules of the cookie and Nutella mix in my mouth and create a great taste. That sounds right. Huh? Medicine, sweets lighten up your mood. And you can write a poem about it. What about peace? It doesn't need explanations. Sweets are goodness, and goodness is a peaceful world. <laughs> you should write a paper about it while I'm finishing our craft. Guys, do not forget to be careful working with a hot glue gun. Also, you can always ask an adult to help you. By the way, which invention do you think is the most important in the world? Write in the comments. And we'll need two cardboard legs like these. And feet, of course. Sammy, I need your help. Bring me more straws, please. Just a moment. I even cut them for ya. Thank you. Also, can you make a head for the dinosaur? You spoke so much about sharp teeth. Making teeth is a delicate, creative work. Plus, only you know how this T-Rex should look like. Meanwhile, I'm adding a little glue with this syringe. It needs patience. Did I become your assistant, Susie? Anyway, as usual. Sammy, what do you mean? You just know better what to do. <laughs> Guys, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell. Sammy's always happy to see new subscribers. Fixing these little wooden details. And... Done. I thought I'd forgotten the robot from my dream, but it's unforgettable. This is a secret detail of the head. The upper cardboard layer is cut in the middle. Up. Let's glue the cube. Now, I only need to make terrifying sharp teeth. Well, Sammy, how's the head? Rawr! Um, which head? <laughs> hey, I'm talking about the robot's head. Let's fix it onto its place. Right here. And now I'm going to put a button into this hole. Perfect. Oh, I guess Sam left it here. Don't forget to subscribe! Did you see my message? Yes, Sammy, and I already reminded the viewers to subscribe. And to hit the bell not to miss any of our new videos! Look, Sammy. All the mechanisms are going to be on display. And hop! Oh, I can spend hours watching it. So that's an old battery. I was going to give it for recycling. It'll be useful. It'll help our robot keep balance while walking. Brilliant. The student surpasses the master. All right. I guess you're ready. Although, something's missing. Are you ready? I can't wait to see my creation! It looks just like the one in my dream! So 
you're the best assistant. <gasps> Thank you. And I've got a prize for you. It's not the Nobel, but I think you'll like it. Wow, thank you, Sue. It's even cooler. Bye, guys. See you soon. Bye now. 